All right guys, so this week we're gonna be taking a look at the Maxion lights. This is some of the lights that I own. Obviously this light right here, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen on tool trucks in the past. It's a very popular light and almost everybody's got one, or at least almost every shop has one. So without any further ado, let's dive into these Maxion lights and I'll show you some awesome lights that will save you some money. Let's do it. All right guys, so last week we did a video on the Streamlight lights and I showed you all the lights that I personally own. This week I wanna feature Maxion as they make some excellent lights. Like I said in the intro, I'm pretty sure you've seen this light on one of the tool trucks before. I know I purchased one under the Snap-on brand. Um, I've actually had a couple under the Snap-on brand. They're excellent lights and we'll cover each one of the models that I personally own and I'll talk about them. But they've got a ton of different lights that will fit any of your lighting needs. Just like this light, they've got one that's a little bit longer, that's twice as bright. But we'll cover all of that in the video. Maxion makes some fantastic lights. Obviously, as you guys have seen these in shops before, they're very high quality lights at a very low price point, which is great for us at the end of the day. So we'll start with this line here and I'll show you what I have in front of me and then we'll talk about the difference in lights and what they offer. Um, you can always check them out on Maxion's website. Before we dive into this, this is not a sponsored video. Maxion did not send me any of these lights. These were all lights that were purchased myself. They did not send me lights for the review. So this is not a paid sponsorship or a paid endorsement. This is my opinion on their lights. So it is what it is. So these are all my personal lights. So let's start with the Maxion light here. This is the 813 Workstar Cyclops light. As you can see, it does have a magnetic base along with the threads in it if you want to put it on a tripod. It is adjustable. You can spin it in pretty much any different direction that you want to spin it in. One of the features that I really like about this light, you can see on the back, it does have a battery gauge. So that's going to keep you from getting left in the dark. Um, we've all been there working on something and the light goes dead and then you're left in the dark. So that sucks. It's always nice to know how much juice you have left. That way you can swap it out or throw it on the charger for the next job. But these lights are super affordable. Um, you know, they're all over the place. I'm really not going to talk about prices because if you buy them from a tool truck, obviously they'll be a little more than you buy them from Amazon or wherever else. But at the end of the day, they're super, super affordable. You can Google these and pretty much find them for the price you want to pay for them. But let's talk about some of the specs with this light. On high, it has a 720 lumen, two hour runtime. Medium is 360 lumens, four and a half hours of runtime. Low is 180 lumens at 10 hour runtime. Takes three hours to charge it. Um, it does have USB-C charging, which is freaking fantastic. You guys know I'm a huge fan of the USB charging that's on the back of these. It's got a rubber flap. You just simply pull it up, USB-C's there. Um, it's got a very strong magnet on the bottom. Holds very well. They did a great job with this. All right, the light itself is three and a half inches tall. It is two and seven sixteenths wide, and it is an inch and an eighth um, thick. That's not counting the handle area. Um, but it's simple operation on this light. It's got a rubber button on the top. You press it one time. That's low, which is 180 lumens. Second click is medium, 360. And the third click is 720 lumens. And the next one's off. Very nice light. It's very lightweight. It is a fantastic light. It comes in several different colors. I know they got them in green, red. 
and this is their newest color, which is orange, which is pretty cool. They may have some other colors. I'm not 100% sure. You can just check it out, but I kind of like the orange. It's something different than I didn't have. Um, the next slide I want to talk to you about is their Maxion Scout. Um, it's in their search point line. They've got a couple of different models of these. They got one that's a bigger version that's a thousand lumens and we'll cover that also. I don't own that light, but it is a pretty cool light. I have seen it in person. I played with it um, and it is very bright. But this one is, is, is pretty cool because you can see how small it is, but what makes it unique, you can spin the head around, the pocket clip will swivel around so you can put it in your pocket if you want to have it like that, or you can put it on your hat, um, it's pretty cool. But just the swivel feature is a nice touch to this. Um, it does have a magnetic base, and once again, USB-C charging. It's a rubber plug that covers it here on the side. It's a fantastic little light, very good magnet on it. Like I say, you can swivel the head around if you've got a magnetic surface to work on, and it will work in any angle. So like if you've got it, you know, magnetized here and you need to turn it, you just simply turn the, the magnet on the wall or whatever you got it magnetized to, to get the angle you want. It's a great idea. It's a fantastic little light. Let's cover some of the features of it and how bright it is. It is a 600 lumen, two hour runtime on high a 180 lumen, six hour runtime on low. Um, like I say, it is USB-C, it's got a magnetic base and the um, belt clip that comes with it. It's a very nice little light. It's 3.6 inches long, uh, 0.8 inches wide, and 0.8 inches in diameter. So it's a pretty cool little light. All the specs from these lights come off of Maxion's website, so that's where I get all the measurements. I don't sit here and actually measure these things, but I go by what they do because they got people that's paid to do that, and hey, might as well use their work. But anyway, that is the Scout. Um, like I say, they've got a bigger one that's called a Search Point, I believe is the name of it. It's a thousand lumens. You can check it out. These lights are super, super, super affordable. There's no reason for anybody not to own a rechargeable light. In today's world, for the price of them, I remember back when I was younger, a rechargeable light was super crazy expensive, and you kind of had to make a lot of money to own a rechargeable light. Well, today it's kind of the reverse has, has happened. They're super affordable. Battery technology's got better. The lights are brighter. They last a whole lot longer, and they're a whole hell of a lot cheaper. So be sure to check these lines out. I promise you, you're going to be surprised when you see the price, and they're actually really good lights. So the next one I want to talk to you is a very cool little light. It's called the Luma Stick. This is the Luma Stick 10. Um, they've got one that's longer. It's a 12 inch version. This one's a 400 lumen light. The 12 inch version's a 800, I believe. I think it's double. Super bright light. I wanted the smaller light just to get in more confined spaces and work with. And plus it's small enough. You can leave it in your door pocket. You can stick it in your pants pocket whatever, really cool light. So obviously it folds out. Um, if you notice, it's got a light here, it's got a light on the end, and it's got the long light back here. Now I'm a fan of the blade lights. Um, I, I really like them just because you can get them down in tight spaces. They throw off a lot of light and you don't really have to have a big light anymore. I know you guys probably remember the old fluorescent looking style like the snap on lights and I think even, um, Milwaukee had one and uh, anyway, tons of brands had those long lights. Well, they were, they were really big, you know, there's like a two inch tube you had to try to shove down in there. When these blade lights come out, well, it changed the whole game. These things are amazing. Super bright light and they take up a whole lot less space. But anyway, obviously it folds in half, it goes in your pocket, it's got a magnetic clip on it that holds itself very well. It also comes with a belt clip um, it's got the rubber power switch on this side. On this other side, you can see, once again, the rubber plug peels back and it's got a USB-C charging port inside, which is fantastic. Everything should have USB-C now. Um, it's just a lot better design, in my opinion. 
but one click gets you your tip light, the second click gets you your long bar light, and the third click gets you the little light on the back side. The next one will turn it off, and like I say, you can cycle them through them. Um, super cool little light. I like the way it folds up. I like how thin it is, and it's extremely bright. So let me cover the runtime and the lumens on it. That way you guys will have the full rundown of all these lights. All right, like I say, it is a 400 lumen light. Um, it has a three hour run time. Uh, the, it's 120 lumens on the side light, the little light that's on the back. And it has a five hour run time on it. It's 11 inches overall folded. It's 5.8 it weighs 4.5 ounces. Um, it's just a fantastic little light. Like I say, the 12 inch is a 800 lumen light. Uh, it, it'll probably have close to the same runtime if I have to guess. Like I say, I'm not paid by Maxion, so you know I don't know all their part numbers and their specs or whatever. So you can just look them up online. But I'm just telling you what I know about what I got. But Fantastic light, so be sure to check these out. Like I say, you're not gonna find a better light at a price point that they're at. I think it's got a one year warranty on all these lights. You can also look that up. Don't hold my feet to the fire. I'm not paid by Maxion. I'm just here to show you what lights got. Um, great lights, I think it's a one year warranty. Super awesome price point. But anyway guys, be sure to check out Maxion. They got neck lights, they got headlights, they got um, bigger lights, they got smaller lights. Like. You got pretty much any kind of lights you want. And like I say, this light's probably the most famous out of all of their lineup. Um, I know the snap-on light that I had, I had a red one and it lasted forever and I messed it up with a charging port. That's another reason why I like the USB-C. I pushed it up inside, tried to fix it, never did work right after that. Bought another one, it was green and I honestly lost that light. I have no clue where it's at anymore, but it is what it is. This is a fantastic light. I will attest to that. They've got a different version. If you want one that's got the focusable beam, they offer that also. Um, I'm not really the focusing beam kind of guy. I like them to be like they are. So this is my lot of choice. Anyway, guys, that's the video. That's Maxion Lights. Check them out on their website. And like always, if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, be sure to click that button. There's links in the description. You guys have a great week and we will catch you later.